Today we are going to revise the concept of subtraction and its properties. What is subtraction? When we remove or take away objects from a group and count what is left, that process is called subtraction. Take the example of this shopkeeper. If he has 57 apples in his shop out of which he sold 34 apples to the lady and you have to find out how many apples are left. You will subtract 34 from 57. For that you will write 57 minus 34 and when you subtract you get 23. We can say that he has 23 apples left in his shop. We'll quickly revise the terms used for the numbers in subtraction. From the previous example we know that 57 apples minus 34 apples is equal to 23 apples. The number 57 from which we subtracted is called the minuend. The number 34 which we subtracted is called the subtrahend. And the answer 23 is called difference. Which means the terms of subtraction are minuend minus subtrahend is equal to difference. Always remember that the minuend is greater than the subtrahend. We'll move on to the properties of subtraction. Property number one, the order of the numbers is very important in subtraction. It is always the smaller number that is subtracted from the bigger number. For example, if I ask you how much is 25 minus 14, you will write 25, below that minus 14, 5 minus 4 is equal to 1, 2 minus 1 is also equal to 1, the difference is 11. But if I interchange the numbers and ask you how much is 14 minus 25, your answer will be it is not possible. Property number 2. On subtracting 0 from any number, the difference is always the number itself. Example, 59 minus 0 is equal to 59. Or 275 minus 0 is also is equal to 275. Property number 3. On subtracting 1 from a number, the difference obtained is the predecessor of that number. For example, 70 minus 1 will be the predecessor of 70 which is 69. 225 minus 1 will be the predecessor of 225 which is 224. Property number 4. On subtracting the number itself from a number, the difference obtained is always 0. So if you subtract 49 minus, uh, sorry, 48 minus 48, it is 0. 671 minus 671 is also equal to 0. Before I end this video, let us quickly revise the terms of subtraction once more. The number from which we subtract is called the minuend, which is always the greater number. The number that is subtracted is called the subtrahend, which is the smaller number. 
and we cannot interchange the minuend and the subtrahend. 